In the shadowy depths of our modern healthcare systems, a silent and ominous danger lurks. A creeping empire of antibiotic-resistant bacteria is on the rise. But what can be done to stop it? The discovery of antibiotics in the early 20th century marked a groundbreaking medical achievement. It provided us with a powerful weapon against life-threatening infections. A pivotal moment in this story accidentally occurred in 1928, when physician Alexander Fleming returned from holiday to find a petri dish had become contaminated with a fungus that produces penicillin. When he examined the dish, he noticed that there were no bacteria where the fungus grew. Fleming had unintentionally stumbled upon one of the most potent antibiotics in history. Afterwards, Fleming and other scientists in Britain and the US worked tirelessly to refine and mass-produce the drug. By 1944, penicillin was a standard treatment used by soldiers on the battlefields of Europe. It earned the moniker the Wonder Drug and paved the way for the development of other antibiotics which were widely manufactured and consumed worldwide. These drugs became cornerstones of modern medicine, saving countless lives and transforming the treatment of once deadly infections such as sepsis, pneumonia and diarrhea. However, the golden age of antibiotics eventually gave rise to a new threat, antibiotic resistant bacteria. Excessive and incorrect use of antibiotics in humans and animals played a significant role in the emergence of these resistant strains. When antibiotics are used unnecessarily or not taken as prescribed, bacteria are exposed to sub-lethal doses of the drugs, allowing them to adapt and develop resistance over time. Today, antibiotic-resistant bacteria pose a grave public health challenge, as our current treatments are becoming less effective. These superbugs are making people sicker and will lead to more deaths in the future, as well as higher healthcare costs around the world. To combat antibiotic resistance, scientists are exploring novel approaches, including methods that disrupt bacteria's ability to coordinate their behavior, as well as developing viruses to target specific bacteria. Addressing antibiotic resistance extends beyond the confines of laboratories. It requires everyone to act responsibly by avoiding unnecessary antibiotic use for viral infections, like the common cold or flu. These drugs are ineffective against such illnesses and contribute to the development of bacterial resistance. However, However, if you are prescribed antibiotics for an infection, it is important for you to follow the instructions and complete the course of treatment as instructed. In the face of this global health crisis, we find ourselves at a critical juncture. Overcoming this challenge requires collective action to prevent further development of resistant microorganisms. By being mindful of our antibiotic use and embracing responsible practices, we can contribute to a future where effective treatments remain available to safeguard our well-being.